What's going on my friends? Welcome back. We're playing as the Terran Empire on Grand Admiral difficulty. Last time we made a start, we started uh, relocating some people uh, in between episodes. Here on Twitch, I uh, I got some, uh, some peoples to Earth going towards Endoria and we've queued up a mining network. This will get the stability most likely up. We could also focus on crime, but most likely this crime is all because of unemployment. And so yeah, we just will we'll change that. Uh, working from home and watching your stream, man, that's great. Yeah, I'm. Uh, I think I can do this for another uh, maybe an hour, and then it is uh, work for me as well. Let's just focus on what do these other planets actually? What's the problem? So crime is definitely high over on Tele Prime. Hmm. Do I think on Valk, or do we have a Mars? These are all Terrans, right? Yes, so we could actually get four more jobs filled. And I would like to start filling alloys a tiny bit because making four, <laughs> yeah, that is never going to be enough. So, two, we can transfer. Let's go and change that because that is what we have the population for and we'll change those with not earth but with mars here we go so one two and we are out of cash already uh teleprimes Let's make sure you get into the right jobs. That would be ideal. And we should be making more alloys shortly. There we go. Plus seven and one supply. Making a hundred energy credits. Who knows? We might be able to avert the... You know, but I don't think so. No, we. I don't think we can avert the, um, the rebellion. I think the rebellion is, is pretty, pretty harsh. Also, we have some uh, warp-capable species, apparently, in this system. What kind of people are you? You are... you are humanoid. Auditarian. Ooh. You are... Still alien scum. Yes, you're very greedy. We need to build some armies and we need to occupy this because why not? It's a free planet. And they're very, very early on, which is okay. 22 empties. Damn, dude. That's a lot. So, yeah, they don't have enough specialty specialists. Interesting. Mm. Yeah, we'll have to build up some armies. And we need them anyway, so let's recruit. Oh, there we go. Unemployment on Vulcan. And we have an anomaly here which will leave because we do want to make sure that we survey those uh, systems. Let's go with a... Oh, interesting. No slave armies. Huh. We'll use the Vulcans since the damage of them is higher. 3.6. Let's build three for now and just wait. We'll have to capture this, of course. Bit of lag issue still, but it's not too bad. Like, that's why I usually play on fast, especially with Star Trek New Horizon. It's, it's, it's a heavy mod. It is a heavy mod. It's a great mod, but it's heavy. All of that, we might want to upgrade our ships. Let's see. This is the auto best we'll have to look into. Let's just uh, make sure we got the absolute maximum on those. While removing you. So 25 is the maximum amount of which we can actually have. So we'll wait for those ships. Uh, well, let's look into designs. I will do my best. My absolute best. To uh, make sure that I'll zoom in. Uh, you haven't seen 40k mod. It's something else. Yeah, you you talked about that on, on, uh, on Discord, uh, Wenek. So is it really that good? Tracking, evasion. Evasion is really low on frigates. On these frigates, actually. Let's see. Auto generation off. We can save this as the eminent class. For these, I, 
don't know if I care enough about these. This auto upgrade. We might want to turn off auto upgrade. Maybe. I would say it is an optimized mass. Wow, for you to say it is an optimized mass. That is something. So, that one is building the mining network. What can we build over here? Because we still have a lot of unemployment and we have a bunch of minerals. Hmm. Well, we'll just go with whatever is on this one. Is this going to be a specialist job? I don't think so. So that actually would be nice to get this uh, nitrate. And... We'll go with... More food. Over here on the Noblia. Oh, there's also fertilized collector. Now we're not going to do that because that will just generate one job. And I would like to generate... Let's see. It is also a food plan. Oh, that's fine. We'll do mining. And we'll do more mining. Right over here. Housing is a bit of an issue, which we will have to go into. And that will actually lower crime and increase stability. So that's actually a win. And I do want to focus a tiny bit here. We could buy this and just increase the amount of amenities by 25%. Who knows? We might be able to avert this. <laughs> it would be the very first time that we averted the uh, rebellion, so to say. So let's create that and let's start getting houses. Houses 4, which is fine. Houses 3, 2, 9. Yeah, okay, that's all good. So we are creating Terrans over here. And we'll, we do want to make sure that we get more alloys. Since we have so many other jobs un unavailable, we might as well, right? Hmm. With all of that done, let's see. We get the Light Cruiser Blueprints. And we have the NX class here already. The San Francisco Shipyards. Federal shipyards. Interesting. Spatial torpedoes. Let's go with the NX project. Let's remove all of those. And let's zoom into these uh, ships. And let's not look into the sun directly. Because, yes, I need to think about your eyes as well. Ah, they're so tiny. Yeah, so tiny. You can't really see the yellow on them, and I cannot zoom in any further. Maybe if I select something else. No, we can't zoom in any further, which is good. Okay, we have the light cruiser right now. This is having the pulse cannons. And that is not my favorite. It's a point of defense cannon. I don't like them. I don't like them. I want to have as little of them as possible. So we'll go for the Torpedo Barrage. Let's get some Pulse Weapons on there. And let's get the Fusion Warheads. And this is actually the ships that we are going to be building the most of. Because they have a better survival rate than the, uh, the Eminent class. I think the Eminent class don't even get shields. And the Light Cruiser eventually will. When we get shields, that is. Let's go and... Of course, yes. Of course, I did not need to change that. Let's go here, here. Let's look into module. Oh, wrong ones. I like these a lot better. There you go. FPS cont... Why not? Uh, tracking. Sure. Accuracy, tracking, and evasion. Mm. For small weapons, it doesn't really matter. Because small weapons have such a high tracking, the evasion is not going to do you that much good. As for the additional bulkhead, we have enough power. We can go for regen. Combat disengagement chance. 2%. A combat disengagement chance if you want to save your ships is quite important. Hmm. 
I will go for the um, the regen right now. Apparently, once again, I am unable to change this name. Okay, so we'll do it like this. Save you. Thank you. Let's get rid of you. And... Wow, they really do not like us to use that name. It is fine. Let's go back to our fleet and make sure you are on the right cruiser. Lower those. And let us add the... Let's bring you back to 16. Now add the light ships. Get as many as possible. Five is actually not bad. Five is not bad. Let's wait. Let's see if it actually triggers or not. Scientific <clears throat> breakthrough achieved. Uh, we got the phase weapon. We, we do want to upgrade our ships. Command station. Hmm. Yeah, let's just grab for get for the. Uh, let's go for the gravity manipulation. Five hundred. Okay. Uh, that is a lot. I won't say anything else because that is a lot. I don't think we can actually do that. Everyone is building. What's your problem? You have one unemployment. Stability is still a problem. And it's because we just don't have enough Terrans. Now, let us just increase these jobs. Because I don't think we can actually do it. Oh, we have two more available. We have enough energy. So, let's go to... Is it Pajem we were working? Uh, no, you're not unemployed. Endoria. Yes. Go one. <clears throat> and... Give me a second there. Eh? Wow, that was annoying. I've been um I've been I've been uh, grinding my drywall um of sanding sanding the drywall and that is dusty like crazy. Yeah, I do not like it. Let's see, we still have unemployment apparently, so let's change all of that. Was well, so one Terran that is unemployed? That is not what we need. Let's get you all the way back into your good jobs. Oh, I think we might have transferred one too many. Which is not bad. We can actually transfer one from Teller to Endoria. There we go. So now we now have Endoria as well. Let's wait until the, um, the stability increases. And it should be increasing. Can we do something about enmities? Well, we are able to. We want to make sure that we buy some more supplies. And then go for the decision of distribution of luxury goods that actually would help that actually would help negative six is quite a big ass deal and we are unable to change that from these settings what do we have over here maximum industry and uh, that's interesting can we actually get another additional pop from it no we are unable to that's oh, such a shame. So, we... Do we want to be growing, growing these guys over there? No. Uh, we need another planet which we could focus on with Terrans. So, get more Terrans. Yeah, we could actually make you... Yeah, let's do that. We're going to be getting some... Regular buildings here. We're going to be transferring some of this unemployment over here. So we already have food. Let's get some more food. And once that's built, we're going to be transferring three more. Ah, here we go. Of course. At least we still have Endorian. To the rebellion. The Terran Empire has been oppressing the alien races. They have subjugated for too long and they are now beginning to rise up against their Terran masters on the Noblian systems. Wipe these aliens out. Yes, uh, we do have to do that. Um, this is... We could actually do a staging point over here. Do you have a station in here? We have a station of 520. 
we could potentially send the fleet over there. So what is this station about? Nothing. We could upgrade you. I don't know. Regional capital has been uh, unlocked. We can start building those now. Hmm. Import water ice. Let's do it. Water ice is uh, is used for your um, your build your city districts. So increasing the uh, the housing actually would not be so bad. We do need to get some police force going because I don't think we have the um, the crime law deals, which would be uh, which would be actually quite nice. Let's get an admiral. What do we have? Ah, uh, combat disengagement chance negative. I do not like that. So we'll go for the uh, the cheap option. Here we go. And do we have enough for upgradation? We do not. Let's see if we can actually manage that. Let's sell a thousand. And we have to be extremely careful because next month uh, my economy might be going in nose diving. He says that while he just sells a bunch. I know. Let's keep our 200, the minimum. And buy more alloys. Let's upgrade this fleet. There we go. There should be enough. Should be enough to upgrade. So 525. We should be getting new face cannons on that. As well as the torpedoes. So we should be increasing our fire firepower. I would really like it to go to about 7. If we can go to 700, then that would be ideal. And we need to change these into naval capacity. Now, if you know of a way to avert this crisis, do let me know. It is uh, something that's been on my mind if you could actually avert this crisis. But I kind of think this is a, um, a fixed event, so to say. So let's build you up and we're going to be sending you over here. Actually, we also have the Gamma Buddhas over here, which is... I did not know we had it. So you're still surveying all of this, which is okay. Let's see, can we get another shipyard in there? Let's wait for a bit of time until upgradation has been completed. Because I think they will still get alloys from... Scientific oh, there we go. A new long-range exploration vessel is ready for construction. I'd say that's a good thing. The NX project, let us proceed. We are tracking an enemy fleet. Okay, let's pause it for a second. Uh, diplomacy or slavery or influence. Let's go with the influence because we can get the capacity overload production targets and farming subsidies. And we'll go with city districts increase. They have a fleet of 770. I kind of would like to send my fleet there to aid this. And uh, if we can get rid of their fleet, then that would be such, such a great achievement. But for now, we need to make sure... We upgrade, because that's going to be way more important. We can always take this back with the NX class whenever it is done. Let's see if it's in here. No. Vulcan has some unemployment, so let's increase the, uh, the building. Overcrowdingness. No, I don't want that. Let's uh, increase all of these jobs. And let's go for... Yeah, let's go for some more mining. Why not? That should bring us to our limit. Regional capital as well as mining building. Yeah, I think that order is not needed. Let's go with the regional capital and then the uh, city district we can think about later. Because the regional capital does increase your housing. So let's save up until we can build that on every planet. Population here is Terran. Yeah, we have another jobs remaining. How many unemployment do we actually have? Three. Mm, we don't need to do this. 
we can just transfer these Vulcans towards Pajem. Decline that because I don't want to lose a slot. That would be quite harmful. Because we would lose the administrative center. I don't want that. So you're not really overcrowded anymore. Okay, once this fleet is done, we're going to be sending it in. Because I think it should be... There's already a fight going on. Come on now. Very close. Can we make it there in time? I do not know. So to victory, the NX class is... Now available here for research, so let's do that. Come on now. Final ship. Our ships have been okay, pause here and go. So it would, oh wow, 241. There is no way. How many can this station take? How much can it take? Not a lot by the looks of it. Will they lose ships? Yeah, it's definitely not in their favor. So combat disengagement chance is when your ship will get that flag sign, you know? Uh, it's, it's when they try to get away. Okay, so there's no bloody way I can do this. It is fine. Let's just uh, stay over there. And we'll go with... Supremacy? We'll get more star bases, army damage. And I want to go for the ship building cost... Because that is just too good to be true. Yeah, there's no way we can actually main manage that in time. We could try to retake it the second we lost it. Ah, I don't want to fight a station and their fleet. Not when we're this close to each other. So what we'll just do is make sure we got jobs everywhere. Yeah, we can grow one more of you. Terrans. Terrans. They have a bunch of Terran jobs here. And we have a lot of them over here. Overcrowdingness will change when we get the regional capital upgrade. Let's do that everywhere. So how expensive is this building? A regional capital. We need the... We need 20 pops. So we cannot even build it over there. Mars, we cannot do that. And we already have it over here. So the rest of the minerals, we can just just nosedive into alloys. Uh, let's get the new fusion warhead. And uh, yeah, I'm going to take a short break here. Thank you for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. For those of you who are watching this on Twitch, stick around. We'll talk a bit.